Hello, today I want to talk a bit about feminism and what it means to me. Two seconds in and I already want to grind my teeth into dust. I feel a lot of people are scared of feminists or are scared of the term itself. Well, if they're scared of feminists, they might have a good reason. My audience knows what I'm talking about. Feeling like it's too extreme of a concept. And even female celebrities have denounced it. Like Kelly Clarkson, Shailene Woodley, Carrie Underwood. And from reading their statements, I think they have the concept confused. You think they have the concept confused? I'm not sensing a lot of confidence in your statement. First off, what I feel feminism means is the empowerment of women. Well, that's your opinion. And guess what? You're wrong. Just because you feel about something doesn't make you right. I can say I feel like I'm being watched by a sexy transparent cheetah. It sounds like I'm a fucking lunatic. It's about encouraging women to pursue whatever they want. Whether they want to be a stay-at-home mom or they want to be a CEO. And even within feminism, there's the criticism that it's only for white women. But really, it is for all women. It's for women of color. It's for women of the LGBTQ community. To exclude a certain group, that's not feminism. This video came out before the whole Bohar Mufasa thing in college where she states out, It's impossible for a class that is privileged to face sexism or racism from someone who's less privileged. And lots of feminists with agrees with her. Hell, there are people within the feminist community to segregate the whites from the blacks. Though I get why there's Latina feminism, I get why there's womanism. Different races have different experiences in this country. But real quick, let me talk about what feminism is not. It is not about hating men. It is not about hating men. It is not about hating men. You can say that as much as you like, but when there is quotes made by feminist feminists that have a following that dehumanizes men, it seems to me that feminism is about man-hating. Hating men is called misandry. That is not the same word as feminist. They might as well be synonymous. Feminism is not about creating a matriarchal society. There's no feminist agenda for taking over the world. It's just about playing on a level field. Some women don't see the need for feminism. They are completely fine with men making the decisions in this country. Literally, a room full of politicians, all male, deciding what rape means. Literally saying about rape that the body has a way of shutting that down to prevent it. That's a different topic. I'm getting a bit into rape culture there, but that's how it is. You know that some of these women don't need feminism because they pretty much see feminism as a movement that is begging for special treatment while disguising it as a right that they don't have. Also, the definition of rape is slightly different for men. It is made to penetrate. However, feminists will go as far as to deny that men cannot rape, I mean be raped, by women because even if they was made to penetrate, he was most likely enjoying it. And of course, there's the famous argument of women making 77 cents for every dollar a white male makes. But in case you didn't know, that's for white women. I, on the other hand, being a Latina, make 56 cents for every dollar. There's already something wrong with 77 cents, but 56 cents? That's not even a stat I hear often. So the wage gap has once again been debunked. Like always, I'm going to leave a link in the description. And here's a little fun fact. Asians make more money than white people do in America. Strange. Where is our privilege over Asians? So what does it mean to be a feminist? What does it mean if one day you decide, all right, I'm going to call myself a feminist now? It's about building up other women. I'm sorry, but a moment ago you said that feminism include races and not excluding anyone. You're saying that feminism is building up for women. You fucking sexist. What about African-American men or Jewish men? What about the poor men in the streets? Check your fucking privilege. And this is coming from a Puerto Rican male. It's when someone makes a sexist joke and calling them out on it. Jokes are jokes. They can't hurt you or anyone. It's about teaching boys to not rape instead of teaching girls to not get raped. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. The problem is not the fact that some people don't care about the law. The problem is that men are not being taught not to rape. And you're telling me that feminism is not about man-hating? You're literally placing this stereotype where, by default, every man is a rapist. It's about encouraging women to speak up and let their voice be heard. You see, you're totally not contradicting yourself right now. Or not to be afraid to enter a job field that is predominantly male. Initially, I wanted to be a director. That's changed, but when I started telling people I wanted to be a director, I was fortunate enough that no one said, no, you can't do that. I remember my first semester of college going in with my advisor and telling him, I want to be a director, 
and him just going straight into it of saying, okay, these are the classes that you need to take. So you're pretty much contradicting yourself. Somehow, feminists complain about not enough women in certain fields because they fear that women might take over the world, yet you're facing no challenge on trying to get this certain field. This is pretty much destroying the feminist cause.